If you're using MailChimp and you want to send maybe your guide, like a downloadable PDF, to anyone that signs up to your newsletter, but don't know how to do it, this tutorial's for you. I'm gonna show you how it's done. I'm Mike, and let's go to the computer. Corny. All right, so I'm logged into MailChimp, and what I wanna do is show you step-by-step -step on how to add your PDF file, let's say your, your free guide or ebook, and where you, where you put it in the email sequence so that as someone signs up to your newsletter, uh, they're eventually presented with an email that says, download here uh, my, my new, my, my ebook, for example. So I'm just gonna walk you from the beginning and, uh, and let's see, hopefully this will help. So the first thing you have to do is you need to create a list. So let's do that. I'll just call this uh, yeah webadu test. Uh, just a few examples. Um, like, you know, the series why? Uh, you have to do your. I'm this because it's uh, uh, because you opted in our plan. And then I will save this. Okay, so now my list has been created, and what I need to do now, so where the magic happens, is here on the sign up forms. So you go to sign up forms, and then this form builder. And what you're going to see here is. This dropdown has lots of, so what each of these represent is a different email that could be sent to someone. So you have to think about it with, when you sign up to a newsletter, what's going on? So normally you sign up somewhere, so this is sort of the sign up form, and then you're usually presented with a, an email saying, oh, can you please confirm your email, or please confirm that you wanted to subscribe to this newsletter, and then there's some sort of thank you uh, letter. So. Um, thank you email so these are some various ones and then if if a person does want to unsubscribe uh, from your newsletter these are also other uh, sort of emails or messages that they're going to see so as you can see here this is just a sign up form so this is uh, kind of what it looks like by default and then you can you can modify it you can change the text uh, you can say I don't want someone's last name you can remove these things and you would see here this is the the link so if you don't have this, if you don't have your newsletter, uh, let's say integrated into your website, or if let's say you wanted to pass your newsletter, you wanted to get people to sign up in other places, let's say uh, on Facebook. So instead of driving people to a, your website, you could just drive them to this form and then they would fill this out and this would start the process. So the email that you need to be concerned about when it comes to your PDF, file is here, the final welcome email. So just think of the process, so someone signs up, they've confirmed, and then there's another email saying welcome and uh, great to have you on board kind of stuff. So just check this, because we want to make sure that it's sent. And here's the thing, it says um, your subscription to our list has been confirmed. You can leave that, but most people would change the text, so I'd probably say something like awesome. Uh, Awesome, welcome, uh, well, welcome, welcome, well, let's say welcome to the, welcome to the group. Awesome, the group, uh, and I'll say, as you're just starting out, let's get you to see, uh, here's my free uh, ebook on how to speed up your way. And the reason, and uh, I'll just put like, download here. Okay, so, the reason that I said a free ebook on how to speed up your website is, I'll just go to my desktop, I've got my PDF here, and this is about, yeah, it's basically something that I would offer, um, how to speed up your website. So what I want is that when someone signs up to my email, they're going to receive this. I'm sorry, when someone signs up to my newsletter, they'll receive that. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna highlight download here and then go to this link and it says link to, and I wanna link to file. So what I wanna do is so you can see it right here. Um, this is this is the actual file. I'll, I'll just see if I can just, oops, I'll see if I can re-upload it just so just be consistent with the video. Might say there's a copy, let's see. Okay, no, it's good. So link to there, okay, and it gives me, so now my PDF has been uploaded into MailChimp and I just click insert and it should be okay. Uh, and just to double check, I'm going to just copy this URL and just see 
if I paste it, I should be able to see it. Yeah, great. So it's there. Okay, let's exit out of there. Okay, so great. So now I just save this, close this, so, and then there's the link. So when, so what is going to happen is this is going to be an email that a person would receive, and here they can just click here and download my my ebook. So all right, so that's what you have to do on the Mailchimp side. Let's just run through uh, the tests. So let's just test it out and and just make sure that it works. All right, so what I'm going to do is test it out. I'm just going to go to this URL that they uh, give me. Let's paste it, and then this is the form. Okay, and I want to use, I just want to use this email. Uh, let me just grab it. Uh, so, boom, I just fill this out. So, Mike M, all right, subscribe to list. And so, before we subscribe you, so it's just at making sure that I'm not a robot. So let's click there. All right, subscribe to list. Thank you. All right, so subscription confirmed. If I go here to my email, I should receive something. Yes, so subscription confirmed. So welcome. So here it is. Here's my, so I've been to the group so you can, the messaging can be better, but basically you'll see here the link. So download here. And if I click that, then I can, I can read the PDF or download it. Okay, so hopefully this helps out. It just makes it a little clearer where the link and, the, and your PDF needs to go. I would recommend to try to polish this page up a little bit, make the text a little bit more exciting and, and maybe share some tips about what it is that you're going to do. But the main point here is you can now, anyone that signs up to your, uh, to your newsletter can get access to, this free, to your free ebook or whatever it is that you wanna offer, which can be a great way to start a, a relationship with your soon-to-be customers okay hope this was helpful thanks a lot I hope this was helpful uh, it's a question that came from a couple clients and it's something that it's it's not so straightforward so hopefully this was helpful to you if you have some other questions regarding other softwares or you want to know how to do something let me know in the comments or just send me a message there might be a solution and let's see what we can do all right thanks for your time have a great day Thank <laughs> you.